Hello all, JT here. From time to time and for whatever reason, your Lattice's connection to MetaMask may have some issues or errors when signing transactions related to various smart contracts or similar complex Ethereum interactions. In this video, we will demonstrate the simple steps needed to remedy and refresh your connection to get your Lattice back to working smoothly with MetaMask. Keep in mind, none of these actions will remove your Lattice loaded custom address labels or your ABI packs. All of that data will remain safely stored on the Lattice. This whole process takes just a few minutes. Let's get started. First off, remove all Lattice accounts from MetaMask. Simply click on all hardware enforced accounts, then click on the three dots to open the account options menu. Please note, we are only removing hardware connected wallets. If you have hot wallets on MetaMask currently, just leave those be. Click Remove Account. Proceed to remove all of your Lattice and SafeCard hardware connected accounts by repeating this process. Next, Remove your MetaMask permission from the Lattice by going to the main menu and touching Permissions. Then touch MetaMask and Delete. Reconnect the Lattice back to MetaMask by clicking Connect Hardware Wallet. This will open a new browser tab with the secure Grid Plus Lattice One Connector module. You will need to enter your device ID and a password on this page. Your device ID can be found on the Lattice One main menu screen. Just tap on Device ID. Enter any password you like. This can be reset easily if you forget it. Press Connect. You should see a new screen asking you to enter a secret, which will now be displayed on your Lattice One screen. Once you type in the correct secret, your MetaMask app will be paired to your Lattice One. This will also create a new MetaMask permission on your device. Continue by adding the wallet addresses you would like to interact with. If you so choose, you can give them custom labels in MetaMask just as you did before by clicking on the three dots again and clicking on Account Details. Click the pencil and add a custom name for your account. And there you have it. If the issue persists, try reinstalling MetaMask completely and follow the installation steps in our related MetaMask setup video or follow the guide in our knowledge base. Links to each will also be included in the description below. If you feel your Lattice is still having trouble, please contact us through our support ticket system by visiting gridplus.io and we will take a closer look. For more information, please visit our website and you can also find us on Reddit, Discord, and Twitter. On behalf of the Grid Plus team, my name is JT. Cheers and big hugs from Kansas City.